Ah, Christmas time. You know how it is when you're a kid. All you can think about is all those presents. But as you grow up, it turns to be more about family and, of course, your faith. This story is about one boy, the boy on the right. You see, that's Joe. He's my father-in-law. And that's his brother, sitting in the chair. My wife's dad, he wasn't a die-cast collector, but I did give him a few cars, kind of just to be funny. This tool again I gave him because he helped me do things around the house. Helped uh, rebuild here, fix this. It's one of those things that you do with family. Of course, the carbonator for opening those cold, refreshing drinks on the weekend. Oh yes, and this one. The hot seat. This is the final run version. But when the first edition came out in 1998, uh, actually I gave one to my son. It would have been a couple years after that, about 2000. My son had one. It's a white one, the hot seat. And we were at some banquet or something. I don't remember the event. But we're all around a big banquet table. All the family. We're all dressed real nice. And next thing I know, I turn around. And there's my two-year-old son with his pants around his ankle. And he's getting ready to pee. My father-in-law had put the hot seat on the floor and said, Yeah, you can pee right here. Kids are so gullible. In 2004, I took my mother and father-in-law to a Hot Wheels convention, their first ever. They get to see what it's all about. I took them to the Elliott Handler dinner. They got to see one of the founders of Mattel. I took them to the Peterson Museum to see all the cool cars and an awesome Hot Wheels exhibit. The cars we sold to help pay for the trip, but he kept some of his goodies and he put it up in the toy room where the kids get to play. It was great getting to share my little corner of the world with my in-laws. Unfortunately, this year, it was not so good. Joe passed away, and Christmas is not the same. All the families gathered around for the father of three kids, grandfather of four. So while the family stood by your side, Joe, all through Christmas, praying for you, New Year's Day, you would go home to be with your Father in Heaven. The family misses you dearly, but we know you, you've gone to a better place. God bless.